Healing Tree stands for healing trauma resources, education, and empowerment. We advocate healing from abuse and trauma rather than coping with the symptoms in order to transform lives and ultimately society. We achieve this by providing trauma-focused resources and education and by producing and partnering with relevant film, television, and theater, empowering the social change necessary to create a healing movement. Currently, there's a big knowledge gap between the world's leading trauma experts and professionals across fields, as well as the public at large on this issue that affects so many of us. This lack of understanding is keeping people unwell unnecessarily and spreading the problem. In its most basic definition, trauma occurs when one's capacity to cope is overwhelmed. It can happen from one large event or several small events. While we focus on healing interpersonal trauma, such as abuse, the methods we promote can also help people who have survived war, accidents, and natural disasters. More than one in three women and more than one in four men in the United States have experienced rape, physical violence, and or stalking by an intimate partner in their lifetime. And 60% of American adults report experiencing abuse or other difficult family circumstances during childhood. We recognize that physical violence and sexual assault are not the only forms of abuse nor are domestic violence or child abuse the only contexts in which abuse occurs. One can experience interpersonal trauma in many ways other than abuse, including divorce, having a loved one who is addicted, or the death of a loved one. Traumatic injury can also occur from systemic oppression and discrimination based on race, religion, nationality, sex, gender identity, sexual orientation, and physical or mental impairment. These forms of institutionalized oppression resulting in policy-driven inequities further complicate and even become barriers to the healing process. Additionally, intergenerational or historical trauma can be at play, impacting us epigenetically, affecting how genes are read and switching genes on or off based on our experiences. Trauma is subjective, and it's safe to say that trauma is a fact of life for almost all of us. Trauma literally rewires the brain, and so it often leaves us with mental or physical illnesses, addictions, behavioral or relational problems, which can worsen and be passed on if left untreated. The trauma mental health and medical fields are not integrated, and therefore trauma is commonly overlooked as the root cause of many of the toughest problems our society faces. However, the ACE study shows us that trauma is nothing less than a public health crisis. The good news is that there is hope. Because of neuroplasticity, or the brain's ability to reorganize itself, we know that with proper treatment, healing is possible. Trauma-focused treatment that engages the survival part of the brain, where the fight-or-flight response takes place, allows for the processing of trauma, as opposed to the more common talk therapy, which most mental health professionals are trained in, and often results in obtaining coping strategies rather than real healing. Healing Tree connects those who have suffered trauma with resources necessary for healing rather than coping, provides education to professionals across fields and the public at large that promotes awareness, effective intervention, and cutting-edge treatment and produces and partners with relevant film, television, and theater, empowering the social change necessary to create a healing movement. Together, we can heal from abuse and trauma.